No bullshit, straight to the point. The reflex implementation in CS2 is bad, very bad. And because of that, the 1% lows in Counter-Strike 2 are messed up. Doesn't matter if you're using reflex or not. And these 1% lows are responsible for the smoothness and boosting them is really important. I literally gained 30% more 1% low FPS by doing 3 easy steps that I'll share right after a quick word from Skinland. Skinland, a platform where you can buy or sell your CS2 skins easily. Prices are way cheaper than Steam Market with a huge collection of skins available. With various deposit payment methods including crypto as well as the fastest payouts in the market, Skinland got you all covered. Click the link in the description, set your trade link and add the promo code THORCS for $10 bonus if you sell a skin for 100 Make sure to bookmark this website. My PC specifications are Ryzen 7 9800X 3D with an RTX 5070 and 32GB of DDR5 CL30 RAM. I'm using 1920x1080 for the benchmarks on a Windows 11 24S2 build. Look at these benchmarks. All of them were capped at 600fps but none of them were actually locking the game at 600 except when we use the no reflex launch option with nvidia control panel in game fps capping also didn't work despite using no reflex which proves that it's also bugged so let's fix this issue and gain some 1% low fps on our pc step 1 disable reflex in the game step 2 add no reflex in the launch options of cs2 step 3 Lock your frames using NVIDIA control panel or any other tool that allows you to do that. You can lock it at a value your PC averages during the game and that is above your monitor's refresh rate. I am going with 600 for now. You don't have to use FPS max at all so keep it at 0. You are done and now you should see some gains in the 1% low FPS. I hope this helps you. Please leave a comment with your benchmarks. I will be happy to assist anyone in any possible way. Thank you for watching till the end. You can subscribe for more CS2 content.